guys, the Chase Dog here, and welcome to Fortnite Battle Royale on the channel again, guys. That is right. Today we are back with some more Fortnite because the new season has just come out. Now, at the time of recording this video, the season's probably been out for about like maybe eight hours or so. My update took forever, and I passed out waiting on it. But like I said, this is Chapter 2, Season 4. It is the new chapter, and it is the Marvel chapter. So guys, like I said, this is going to be awesome. It's going to have Marvel characters in the Battle Pass. So if you do like Marvel, you're a fan of the Marvel Universe, make sure you let me know in the comments down below and hit that like button hard, guys, but not too hard, because you'll break your computers. Don't forget that subscribe button and the notification bell to join the Dog Squad. Follow me on all my social medias, they're all in the description down below. We do have a Fortnite playlist on the channel where you can find every single video that I have uploaded for Fortnite. I have not uploaded tons, but I have uploaded a bunch of different Fortnite ones where it's similar to this one where we're reacting to the, I guess you could say the cinematic trailer for the new season. We're reacting to the battle pass, reviewing the, the content that we're getting in the battle pass. But we also have like other Fortnite stuff, we've done a bit of the PvP on the channel back when the game first came out, when originally it was only PvP, I've played it since then. I've been an OG on Fortnite for a long time, uh, and like I said guys, I really do enjoy Fortnite, but I do have times where I do get bored with it, but I think this season, your boy's going to be playing this a hell of a lot, because I am a huge Marvel fan, I'm a huge DC fan, I'm a huge anime fan so give me all that goodies I am keen guys so like I said if you are keen as well let me know in the comments down below hit the like button and the subscribe button feel free to check out the other Fortnite Battle Royale content that we've done on the channel and we have some older Fortnite saved clips in my archive that I need to get up on the channel eventually so if you do want to see some more Fortnite guys let me know in the comments down below and I will upload them as well as maybe if they bring out some game modes in this one we might also get in and do some of that as well so like I said guys if you do want to also check out anything else on the channel, we have a lot of awesome anime stuff on the channel. We have a lot of awesome unboxings, let's plays, sports games, whatever, fighting games, anime fighting games. You name it, we got it, guys. I am a huge into anime right now. I'm pumping out the anime games. Like, if you saw the backlog of games that I have for anime games right now, you would literally lose your mind because there are some awesome names coming to the channel in the future, guys. So, like I said... With that being said, just a little bit of a plug on the channel because, you know, Fortnite's, you know, somewhat got a wider variety of people that enjoy watching it and whatnot. But like I said, guys, if you are keen to see anything else on the channel, feel free to hit the like button and subscribe button to stick around and watch some other stuff. But like I said, Fortnite is one of those things that we upload to the channel every now and then. It's not like a big thing that I upload religiously, but you will get some hidden gems here and there from, you know, archived, saved ones from, like, older seasons that I have. As well as, you know, we might even upload some newer stuff depending on what they bring out. And really just kind of depends on what interests me with this season. So, like I said, let's dive into our reaction slash review of the new Fortnite Battle Royale. Season 4 in Chapter 2. Let's do it, guys. Okay, here we go, guys. It's Iron Man. Probably one of my favorite male characters in Marvel. Oh, yoink. Gamora. And of course, Wolverine. Haha, <laughs> no please. I believe it is Gamora. It might be She-Hulk. I'm pretty sure it's Gamora though. Jeez. Jonesy, come down. <laughs> Lol. Storm. Calm down, everybody. Stop. That way. It's Galactus. Nexus War, hey? Very nice. Very, very nice, My boys. My are broken. But I know I brought these mighty warriors here to defend our reality. Hmm. High above this strange 
land is where we'll prepare to stand against him. Okay. Galactus, the devourer of worlds. We must remember who we are. Storm. Iron Man. Mystique. Mystique. Doctor Doom. Doctor Doom, eh? She Hulk. Yeah, see, it is She Hulk. I don't know why I thought it was Gamora. <laughs> You are great. Our greatest war begins here. Now, we will explore this land. This is cool. Regain our powers and reclaim our memories. Join us. Together, we will defeat Galactus and save all reality. Very nice, very nice indeed. Okay, guys, so, like I said, I thought it was Gamora at first. I don't know why I thought it was Gamora. Um, like I said, just woke up, so what do you expect? But yes, it is She-Hulk. Uh, I, I love the fact that Mystique's in the game. I'm a huge fan of Mystique, huge fan of Storm as well. Uh, Iron Man and, of course, Wolverine, another awesome pair as well. Uh, Doctor Doom, that's interesting that we get a villain in the game as well. Um, I hope we get Rocket Raccoon as like a little like back bling to like, you know, just rock around. Not just like, you know, just for uh, exclusive for Groot. But uh, by the looks at the top, we've got a baby Groot as well, so that's cool. And yeah, Thor, you know, it's not too bad. I, I don't mind Thor. Um, but yeah, so I think I'm pretty keen for all of these characters, to be honest. But like I said, I'll probably play the most with Storm, Mystique, Iron Man, and probably Wolverine. But of course, like I said, I'll still play the other guys from time to time. But I'm going to go and buy the Battle Pass guys, like the, of course, this one, the level... 25 one because I always get that one but like I said I will meet you back once we bought it guys okay guys we've just bought it I bought the 25 one, like the 25 tier one like I always do it's just easier if I do it that way okay so let's see what we got boys let's see what we got okay so of course by the looks of it Thor is the first character that you start with so uh, by the looks of it we might only be getting one character at the start which is very interesting um, but yeah, so Thor, I'm guessing, is the level 1. We will go back to, of course, after we've scrolled through all this, we will go back and have a look. Uh, but of course, we got a Bifrost Glow as a trail, which is, or Contrail. But I like the fact that we got, like, you know, Thor, and he's got, like, that kind of effect to him, where it's, like, stars and whatnot on him, so I like that. Very nice. Uh, of course, spray, but I don't really care for sprays. We got his back bling, very nice. The MCG. Okay. Not too bad. Banner. Oh, we got what's this? Challenges. Includes Majolni Awakening Challenges. Okay, okay. So we get some challenges here and there. I'm keen for that. Uh, loading screen of Herald's Hammer. I, I, I like that a lot. Like, that is awesome. Like I said, there's going to be a lot of things in this one that I think I will like. Even just like the things like the loading screens, because like I said, future fan of Marvel and whatnot so I'm pretty keen for that uh, we got Starshine as a wrap not too bad it moves as well so I like that uh, spin it around it's literally like that so it's, I pro probably will use that it does look pretty decent uh, the MCG I'm guessing this is gonna be something similar to oh is that a comic it's just not loading in oh, okay it's just a an image of him but I feel like maybe this will be similar to like the umbrella that we had on the last season where you yeah like I, I don't know like Unless this is like a style that you can have, like for your glider, where you can have like a comic look to it. Whereas if that's the case, your boy's going to be having Mystique probably on his glider. Waste of time. Uh, of course, we got Asgardian Emoticon. Very nice. A glider. Wait, wait what? What do you mean a glider? What, we're going to glide with his with his hammer? Like, let that hammer fly. Like, come on now. That's awesome. Uh, we got more challenges. Thor Awakening. Ooh, okay, so maybe different attires and whatnot for Thor and all the characters, which is going to be cool because then you can have Thor looking like that, which is going to be cool. Um, I'm guessing She Hulk's the second character that you get because, as you can see, now we're starting to go out of the Thor stuff and into the She Hulk stuff. Uh, of course, She Hulk Smash. I, I still can't get over the fact that I called her Gamora. But, like I said, I was, like, out of it. So, what do you expect? Uh, ooh, boy, Silver Surfer. I'm keen. Bring him into the game, please. Cosmic Wave. Like, your boy wants Silver Surfer in the game. 
We've got Galactus trying to grab a hold. And then of course we've got Miaskul's cuddle team leader and I don't know who that other one looks like. I can't really tell. I don't think it's a Marvel character, but it could be. I don't think it's a Fortnite character either. Like I am not really sure. But of course we've got Silver Surfer, you know, doing his thing. Uh, we have another MCG one. This is a She-Hulk style. Yeah, so it's like I said, everyone's going to have like their own little um, image on the MCG glider, which I like that a lot. And like I said, your boy's probably going to be rocking Gamora a bit. Like I do like that look of that She-Hulk one, though. It does look very, very cool. So, but like I said, I'll probably go with, um, uh, what's her name? Mystique and probably Storm a lot. And here we have Jennifer Walters, which if you don't know, is She-Hulk. Brains or Brawn, why not both? As you can see, I had that back bling on my character before, but this is She-Hulk in a human, technically, form. Uh, we also have Scales of Justice as a back bling, which is pretty decent. And as you can see, I've been rocking Black Widow, um, just to get the hype ready. We've got a banner, we've got Harvesting Tools, Hammers of Justice, and we've got 400 V Bucks. So we've only got two characters already, just from 26 levels, like, boys, what the hell's going on here? I want to have a look. Okay, so, oh ho ho, boys, look where we're at. So we got She-Hulk, we got Captain America, we got Storm, and we got Thor all in here. Uh, by the looks of it, uh, you got Wolverine out on a mission right now, so that's pretty cool. I like the look of this. We're going to have a quick little browse around, because like I said, we are reacting, and we are reviewing this whole season. Um, like, just the main things that I want to look at. But let's go back to where we all began, and we are starting with... Okay, so this is what happens, like I said, you start literally here. Um, I will also hit the L2, or R2, L2, whatever you want to call it, um, once we're done, to see what the whole, you know, Wolverine part up there and the seven calendar day image is as well. But like I said, at level one, you start as Thor, son of Odin, god of thunder. Yes, he is indeed. Good old Thor. And like I said, we've went through all these, so we're not going to go through and say any of these again. But like I said, like this is literally the way it goes. Um, I'm keen to see this. Reach level 8 and complete the Awakening Challenge. So I'm guessing level 8, like actually like account level. Um, and maybe you get the that as like a harvesting tool, which is going to be cool. Like I like that. Or Because we didn't get it, we just got the challenges. So maybe if you get level 8, you'll unlock the actual Hammer or Thor. Which is cool. I like that a lot. Um, I really like the loading screens. They're really cool. And then, of course, the, um, the MCG glider. Having, like, you know, the effects of, like, the... I guess you could say the images. Like, the comic book images. If not, like, maybe the images from them in the game. On it. Which is awesome. I like the fact of the awakening as well. Oh, he's spinning. So... Visit Bifrost Marks as Thor. Okay, so there's three different challenges by the looks of it. Um, let me go back to Thor. Did he have any, like, if you just leave it on that, it scrolls past? No, okay. So I'll have a look at that when we go back into the game, I guess. But yeah, so this is cool. I do like that. Only the worthy can raise Modron here in battle. Okay, now we've went out of the Thor side. And now we're into her. So maybe they all have, like, 15 levels each. Because he's, like, 15 levels he's done, in a way. And now we're on to, of course, She-Hulk. And like I said, we got this one, which is, of course, Jennifer Walters. I don't know if this one changes into her or not, or maybe you unlock her as well, and there's, like, two different attires, because it's not changing into her. But either way, like, Jennifer Walters is pretty fine either way. So I don't mind. Um, I believe maybe, like, the challenges, as you can see right there at 29, maybe once we get to that, uh, maybe you'll unlock her in the She-Hulk form, which is cool, because then that means that you're stuck playing as Jennifer Walters, but then if you do her challenges, you get to play as a She-Hulk version, as a different skin type of look, which is cool. So, now we're at to where we are, 26 levels in the Battle Pass already, boys, and we are going to go and have a look at the next thing. We have a loading screen carrying the team. Uh, do we see anything else? We see a weird fish type of princess. Uh, weird angler fish type of looking dude as well. So that's maybe two skins coming to the game in the future But she hulk just lifting the battle bus up and saying hey get off of these people And then of course we got a emoticon of course flexing on the haters and then 
She-Hulk. Okay, so transform into She-Hulk. Yes, like I said, I predicted that. Gemma Overload. So, you play as Jennifer Walters, you do her challenges, like, you have to obviously get that first and then do her challenges. Um, and then once you do that, then of course, you can reach level 29 and complete the Jennifer Walters Awakening Challenge to unlock the She-Hulk, by the looks of it, and run around as She-Hulk, which, like I said, Jennifer Walters looks pretty good, but now that I'm getting a proper look at She-Hulk, she looks pretty decent as well. So I'm pretty keen to play as her as well. If you do know me, guys, you know that I pretty much play as majority of the girl characters in Fortnite. But I do like, you know, some of the males, so it's going to be interesting. Now, this is where it comes into play of I'm wondering if we're going to get Rocket Raccoon as like a backling or if he's just going to always be on Groot's back. We're going to find out, but we've got Saplight as a Contrail, which is pretty decent. Uh, so far, I have not hated on anything because, like I said, I am a huge Marvel fan and I'm a huge fan of all of these type of things and I am very very keen to see this all in here. We have a back bling of Baby Groot doing a dance, well Sapling Groot, but technically Baby Groot. Uh, reach level 32 and complete the Sapling Groot Awakening Challenges to unlock a certain maybe form of it. So this is a challenge for it which is cool, but I like the fact that you can have Baby Groot dancing on your back which is awesome. Or not even really Baby Groot, this is like I said, it's Sapling Groot, but maybe he'll turn into Baby Groot, who knows. Oh boys, we got a awesome looking skin for the gun, it's literally a Groot skin. I am a Groot on your gun. A spray, okay, Groot glow. But the mic music. I'm not going to listen to the music, I don't really care to listen to the music too much. I just have it playing in the game regardless. Uh, sometimes I don't, but most of the times I do. But a banner, which is Groot. This is cool, Groot's Sap Axes. There's two different versions, of course, you've got these as well. But I'd probably rock these ones. They look pretty damn cool, that's for sure. They are also Groot. Yes, they are. <laughs> and then, of course, we got Groot right here. He is Groot. And he looks pretty cool. He does look pretty cool. I thought Groot wouldn't look that good in the game, but to be honest, he actually looks pretty decent now that I'm seeing it. Uh, moving on. Uh, I believe, yes, we're going to get Rocket Raccoon as a, maybe a back bling, if not, maybe a different version of Groot, uh, similar to how Jennifer Walters turns into the She-Hulk. Uh, you're going to have the other version where you have the option to equip uh, Rocket Raccoon with um, Groot, which that's probably the way I'm going to run it. I'm probably not going to run just original Groot, let's be honest. I'm probably just going to, oh, what's happening here? Um, Probably not going to worry about running just original Groot. I'll probably run the Rocket Raccoon and Groot version because I like Groot and Rocket when they're together. Okay, so we've got the MCG Groot, which is awesome. Oh, and even Rocket holding onto the arm. That's cool. <laughs> I like it. Oh, we've got an emoticon of um, Sapling Groot as well. Some more V-Bucks. A Root Wing. Oh, that's pretty cool. I like that. I like that a lot. That's pretty decent. Uh, Rocket Blaster as a spray loading screen out on a limb so as you can see we have a skin in Fortnite right there on the left that little pine coney looking dude I'm not sure with the other one I don't, that's not Rocket Raccoon no I don't know I think it is Rocket Raccoon on a gun or something or something yeah it looks like it maybe and then of course you got Groot looking at the battle bus as well We've got a banner of Rocket and then yeah so that's cool so you get Rocket Raccoon kinda yes you are Hell yeah, boys. I'm keen to have Rocket hanging around Groot. It looks like he is a bit of a backling because he's kind of hanging around the back area. But maybe he's like an interactive type of one. Don't forget your favorite furry pal. Battle brother. Okay, so maybe he just, like I said, you can go in there with him sitting on your shoulder or he sits on your back and floats behind you and stuff. Kind of like a backling, but not. But that's going to be interesting to see how that works out. So I'm keen for that. Moving on to the next one by the looks of it. We're not even halfway in and we've already went through Groot. Uh, She-Hulk and Thor. So now we're up to Storm. Uh, by the looks of it, I like that. That looks very cool as a wrap. Storm Awakening, very nice. And then we got Storm Strike. I like the whole, you know, lightning bolts behind, which is decent. We got a banner, V Bucks, and then of course Storm, Goddess of the Elements, and she looks awesome. Very very cool. I will be playing her a fair amount. Indeed, indeed, I will. Okay, what else we got? We got her MCG, Storm Volume 3, number one. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. 
uh, harvesting tool, or oh, boys, you can run around with a hand of lightning. It's literally just a lightning blade. Like, boys, you know I'm going to be going out here running like a Kashi with the lightning blade. Ain't nobody coming near my Shidori. Okay. Uh, we've got Stormflight as a lightning... Uh, no, not lightning, but... I've was, I was got lightning on my brain. It's a loading screen. Uh, I don't see any other Marvel characters. I see the Skull Trooper and some type of maybe a fish princess or a burger princess or something but nothing too you know added to like we saw silver surfer like boys like that's why i'm like dissecting those loading screens to see if there's anything else a glider which is literally you just honor like a typhoon type of thing that's cool gathering a storm i like it punk uh we've got 100 v bucks and then of course the challenge is no, oh, it just has a like in like avatar state in a way. Okay, I'm cool. Control the elements. Very nice, Gale Force. So next one's Doctor Doom. He's a good damn menace. He is. Doom juice boys. Banner. Staff of Doom. Okay, okay, not too bad. So of course, you know, him being the only Fantastic Four character in the game, where he's not even really. Like he's the villain of Fantastic Four, but still, um, interesting to see him here. Doctor Doom, eternal ruler of Latveria. Latveria? Latveria. He is Doom. Victor Von Doom. Very nice, very nice indeed. Look at him, he's like blinking at everything. Okay, he, he should be interesting to see how he goes in the game. He's probably one of the least characters I'll probably play in the game, but I still will give him a go. He's level 67, so not too bad. Um, Doom Chalice, okay. Let's see, he's MCG. I want to have a look at that. Let me load it in. Oh, okay, that's cool. That's cool. I like that. Uh, we got the Arcane Energy Glider. Nice. Very nice. Let's see this loading screen. Doom Unleashed. It's just literally just him. Just two different versions, like... Okay, not too bad. Um, we got the Doom Drop. And then, of course. Boys, he's got a goddamn throne! Victory Von Doom. Earn a Victory Royale. And sit in judgment with Dr. Doom's built in emote. Oh, that's gonna be cool. So, literally, there's like a chair emote, right? I have the emote where you just pull up a chair and you just sit down. Boys, you're going to be rocking around as Doctor Doom, pulling out that chair and just sitting there watching people just menacing, just like, <laughs> do my bidding. Okay, very nice. Mystique is the next one after Doctor Doom. Okay, so I have to get to level 80 to get Mystique. I can do that. I can do that. I can wait. It's worth the wait. And look at the glider, boys. Looking fine. Mystique, looking fine. Indeed, indeed. Emoticon of a Mystique. Very nice. Very cheeky. The banner. The books. Identity Crisis. Oh, it looks like she might have killed Bright Bomber. Boys! And what's that coming down there? The steps. But Mystique's got the gun. She's got the scar. She's ready to rumble. That's a cool loading screen. And of course, we got Mystique right here. Deadly Assassin. An undisputed master of disguise. Boys, I am keen to play as Mystique. Love Mystique in the movies. Love Mystique in the comics. I'm keen, boys. Keen. Okay, so we got Mystique Skull on the back. True Mystique. Uh, we got Glided Morphic Blades. Okay, not too bad. Is it Gilded? Gilded, yeah, Gilded. I, I don't know why I said Glided. Um, so, Zip Ribbons, not too bad. Morphic Blue. Oh, boys, that's going to be cool. So it's like the normal weapon, and it is Morphs. Oh, yeah, that's going to be cool. I'm going to rock that one. And then, of course. Oh, she can change. Boys. Eliminate your opponent and borrow their appearance. Boys. That's going to be awesome. I'm keen. So you just, like, rock mystique. You kill, let's say, Bunker Jonesy. And then next minute, you become Bunker Jonesy. And people think, oh, this is the Bunker Jonesy. Nah, boys. I'm a mystique, baby. Very nice. And then, of course, Tony Stark is the next one. Iron Man. And then, I believe, the last one... I don't know who would the last one be. Probably 
Wolverine, maybe? I don't know, we still got... By the looks of it, everyone has two of the, the dots, in a way, because Thor's at the start, so we've pretty much done all of them, so we're going to find out when we get there, but loading screen of, of course, Iron Man, and, you know, it's got different parts and pieces. Very nice. And obviously, it's going to be the same thing, just similar to what it was with um, She-Hulk, where you start as, you know, Jennifer, and then in this one, you start as Tony Stark, and then, of course, doing his challenges, you unlock his Iron Man suit. Very nice. Iron Man back plate. Very nice. I like that a lot. That's cool. The banner. Uh, that's cool. I'm going to be rocking that. Like I said, I like Iron Man. He's definitely one of my favorite male ones. Tony Stark, billionaire, playboy, Phenampolis, and inventor. And it's even got like the... Very nice. I like it. Okay, so he's level 100. So if he's level 100, then there's still two more. So maybe we're going past 100 this season. That'd be cool. That'd be cool. I like that. Iron Man on the glider. That looks awesome. Uh, we got the spray, repulsor blast, harvest tool. That's awesome. Mark 85 energy blade. Boys, uh, come now. Doing it dirty. Okay, we got the glider. Mark 90 flight pack. Oh, yes. That's what I'll be rocking. That's awesome. And then, of course, like I said, level 100, transform into Iron Man. Yeah, buddy. So that means I feel like Wolverine's the next two slides because we've done, I think, everyone. I think that's all of them. Let's have a look. Yes, it is. Okay. 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 No, it's not even that. Okay. Well, what do you know? 100... You know, is the max. Iron Man's the top tier level, you know. So we go Thor, She-Hulk, uh, then it was Groot, then it was, I believe, Doctor Doom, Mystique, and then Iron Man. I don't think I missed anyone. I'll have a quick look. So let's go all the way back to the start. Oh, and Storm in there as well. Uh, so we got Thor at the start with. Then you've got She-Hulk. Then you've got Groot. Then you've got Storm. Then Doctor Doom. Mystique, Iron Man. Okay, not too bad. That's a good lineup. I'd say that's a very good lineup. I'm curious about the Silver Surfer banner. I'm curious if he's going to come to the game because your boy is going to get him if he's going to come to the game. Okay, so let's go in and have a look. So this is obviously the next thing. So I'm just scrolling across with the D-pad. So I'm not even doing it like, you know, differently. Uh, so Season 4 Wolverine Rewards. So he has his own select group by the looks of it. So I don't know how this works, but we're going to find out. Um, by the looks of it, you just have to do... Oh, it's challenges. Okay, so investigate mysterious claw marks three times and you get the spray. So any Wolverine fans out there, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You know, it sucks for you because literally you can't even play as Wolverine because your boys have locked you out and put you on a... I guess you could say a come back every day or come back every six days, every couple of weeks, and then you'll get Wolverine. Not like whereas with the normal Battle Pass, you can just buy your way to 100 and you get all of those Marvel characters in the game, but not Wolverine. Okay, so we got that one. Okay, so we got the Adamantium Slash. Very nice. We got Logan version as well. I hope that's an unlockable, hopefully. Wolverine Trophy. That's cool. He won it fair and square. 20 days in, you get the Ferocious skin as a weapon. The MCG Wolverine in Volume 2. Let's have a look at this. Oh, boys, look at it. It looks so good. This glider is going to be, like, rocked a lot by people. 27, that's like a month. Like, just short of a month. What about Wolverine? Just over a month, you get Wolverine... And of course, the yellow and the blue. He's the best there is at what he does. So you get Wolverine fully unlocked. It like, well, not fully unlocked, but you get Wolverine, which is cool. Um, which then you can play as him. So anyone that is a Wolverine fan, you have to wait 34 days before you can even touch him. Fun times, yes. Yes, it is. Uh, Weapon X as an emoticon. We've got a banner. And then, of course, a built in emote. Okay, that's cool. So he just pulls out his claws and just like, Sha! Now, what's the next thing? So, I don't think that's literally just it for Wolverine. Uh, 
by the looks of it, you get the last 34 days, you get all of these things all at the same day. So that's going to be interesting. But yeah, so literally, you have to wait a month and like, what, four days before you can even touch Wolverine. Uh, so let's have a look and see what the last thing is. Okay, it looks like it's just different skin. So crimson hair. Okay, that looks cool on Jennifer. Very nice. Storm as a punk. It's not too bad. I, I prefer the other Storm, but it's not too bad. Uh, what's that? Oh, okay, so just complete challenges from week one or two. Ten of those. Ten of those from three or four for this one. Of, of course, Storm. For Wolverine, from, you gotta do, um... Of course, you have to unlock the characters as well. But complete from, uh, ten challenges from five or six to get the classic Wolverine. Very nice. And then, of course, you get the Doctor Doom God Emperor skin from doing 10 out of 7 and 8. And then, of course, from 9 and 10, you get the Mystique skin that I'm probably going to rock just as much as the other Mystique skin, the tactical one, which is very cool as well. Like I said, I'll be rocking a lot of the Mystique skins, like this one and the original Mystique. I'm probably going to be rocking the most, because boys, boys, boys. Yes, yes, yes. So not too bad. Not too bad at all. So those ones are pretty much just kind of locked until you get to those things, but not too bad, not too bad, boys, not too bad. Uh, we have, of course, Wolverine Challenges, which we already know. Like, there's literally these things here, like we said. Um, we've got our map challenges, so the map, you know, looking, you know, somewhat still the same. There's a couple of question marks, but not too many. Um, we've got the comic book. Let's see if it's changed. I don't... It, it's never really loaded for me. Um, so as you can see, this is all it does for me. It doesn't load in. So screw the comic, <laughs> screw the comic book. I've had to look at it on the Xbox One uh, just to see what it's like. We've got the punch cards. I really don't care for the punch cards at all. They are literally, in my opinion, a waste of time because I did not even care for the punch cards in the last one. So I don't know why they kept those because waste of my damn. Uh, what have we got? Wolverine challenges. Uh, we got week one and all the challenges and awakening. So four challenges are there which is cool i haven't unlocked a uh what do you call it uh blah, 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 blah. what's the name ah uh, she hulks one okay guys so we're back um like i said um i'm not sure if i will include that in there uh that match that we just did like you start on the you know this that we're on right now the avengers like uh hello hanger or whatever they call it I, i'm not really sure what they call it the big thing that the avengers are on right now as you can see this thing that she's standing on i uh, went in we tried to find the wolverine marks couldn't find it we visited the whole uh the thor's hammer in the ground and whatnot but uh we almost got a kill and then someone third party this but it's okay i don't know if i'm going to include it in there or not i probably didn't but if, obviously if you didn't see it you didn't see it but that's pretty much what happened as a bit of an you know bit of a nutshell but like i said guys so far i enjoy the look of this season I am already at level 26 because, like I said, I bought my way that to the 25 tier thing. So I do enjoy it. I like the fact that you know everyone's you know all there and whatnot, guys. So as you can see, we've got the. Um, I like the fact that everyone's there. So I really enjoy the, the the aspect of all the different Marvel characters and whatnot. So that's awesome. But like I said. Sucks for Wolverine fans because they have to do Wolverine challenges and wait 34 days, but everyone else is free reign. I'm more keen for Storm and, of course, Mystique and Tony, which, of course, they're all towards near the end of the Battle Pass, but I can deal with some of the other characters while I wait, like, of course, playing Jennifer, which is, of course, you know, She-Hulk. But, like I said, guys, if you did enjoy watching the review reaction of this one, I don't know if I've included my match into here because it was pretty much a, a pointless match, but, you know... You get sidetracked when you go into the first match of the season. You don't technically always win them. But like I said, if you did enjoy watching this reaction slash review of Fortnite Battle Royale Chapter 2 Season 4, let me know in the comment section down below, guys. Hit that like button hard. Also, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to join the Dog Squad. Follow me on all my social medias and stay tuned for more stuff, guys. But like I said, Marvel is in Fortnite more and more every day because we already had multiple characters before we had black widow star lord deadpool and the x-force all in there as well as captain america and now we have so many more marvel characters a lot more people are going to be rocking a lot of the marvel characters i believe so like i said guys if you are keen to see a lot more fortnite let me know in the comments down below because like i said if you want 
because like I said, if you do want to see Fortnite more on the channel, you're going to have to let me know, guys. But like I said, who's your favorite out of all of the Battle Pass ones? Are you a bit annoyed about Wolverine being locked behind a 34 wait period? Or day wait period? And yeah, let me know what you think of it so far, guys. Are you going to be getting, you know, to tier 100 to unlock all of them? Are you, of course, going to be doing all of their extra challenges to get their, like, emotes or styles? Let me know in the comments down below, guys. But, of course, hopefully they do a DC one as well. Because, like, they've done a Marvel one now. So, you may as well do a DC season next season. Because, boys, all those DC fans are going to want it. Trust me. They're going to want it. But, guys, like I said, if you enjoyed this one, hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. And, as always, guys, stay awesome. The J-Stog is out of here. See you.